Hi guys, it's the end of February already and I'm filming my K-pop month in review for February now and it was a very nice month but most of these things I actually got them at the end of January and the unboxings just got uploaded in February. I did pretty well, there is only one left of unboxings but there are other videos. So let's uh, get started because um, I have to go soon. So, the first thing I could upload this month was Hello Venus's latest comeback, uh, Mystery of Venus, which is pretty amazing. I'm so glad they finally made a comeback, it took them long enough. Then, in the same package still, I also got the two Sonamu uh, versions of their first single, uh, I Think I Love You. And they're almost the same like the food books, but half of it is uh, different, so I kind of give it a pass. <laughs> uh, so this is the first time I bought two versions for Sonamu, so I would have been pretty upset if I just got the same food book, although they are really cute covers and the design is pretty cool. So, <clears throat> like that. Then the next unboxing I could upload uh, was the big uh, Super Show 5 brochure. This is huge and very very pretty and I actually managed to save the sleeve kind of thing but like I cut the flappy thing off and then just put tape over the remaining sticky part although with the uh, nail polish removal I did like wash it so like it wasn't as sticky but if you've seen the video it's like kind of scary how this was so now it's like an open top but it's still better than how it was <laughs> Then the next things, back to the Ketchup City package, I got the two latest Jiang singles. To be honest, like uh, I don't know how I'm going to keep up because these are over ten over ten dollars and you get like one or two songs and the jewel case and boring packaging. So I got the Korean versions uh, so I can buy it with my Korean albums, which is nice, but you know, still it's just like um yeah, but I also want to support Jiang so I don't know if I'm going to be able to stop or not, uh, I don't know. Then I got another album and it's The Machine Kids Rising Sun because I need to work on their Beauty 5 collection, so yay! I got one album, yay! Then uh, I got this big thing. This is the normal version of Boys in City 4. I already had the limited version for four years or something and uh, I decided that it was time uh, that to buy this because it was on sale so I bought this and finally I have the normal edition as well so yeah and then the next thing uh, first time I think I got the F version of something first so I got Kihan's Japan first Japan full album one voice F version oh so cute then, very random other thing, I got the Sexy Fan Single Japan Singles uh, event version, which is pretty much the only event version I didn't have, and it was a mess why I didn't have this, but now I have it, so it's okay. <laughs> it's very simple. Then, the most exciting things of all, and probably the most exciting thing of the entire year, although it's only February, but most likely I won't get anything any more exciting than this. The two tapes Super Junior had, the first album and the second album, got still got tape versions, and as you can see, unfortunately you can see the ads sticking out, so that's not good, but other than that, I put them back in the weird kind of sleeve uh, that the seller gave me as a second sealing, so they are still technically sealed, uh, I mean technically I only look through these once, they are just not in the original ceiling because that's pretty bad ceiling so yeah this is like everything so I, I can't believe I have these so it's like the most exciting thing the entire year although the year barely begun so yay then back to brochures uh, it's huge as well so I got the SM Town 3 uh, brochure um, it's very very pretty, this was such a nice era. This is from 2012, so the pictures are from 2012, yeah. 
I got this for season extra, but like I really like it, so I don't mind. <laughs> it's just something I wouldn't have bought on its own. And then the rest arrived as well. So here are the versions of Q's first Japan album, the other versions, because we needed four versions for no apparent reason. I just wish then they did more cards, so at least he sells better for with those who who collect all his cards. So it's just like it's strange. So there is a CD only version. Ooh, posters on the glare. Then this is the A version of the CD plus DVD. This is the more special with some knickknack on it. Then uh, this is like the more regular, so it's, it's strange. Like, is this going to be completely out of print, or just going to be a version without the sleeve and maybe less content? I have no clue. But this is more normal, I guess. So this is the B CD plus DVD version because this comes with the regular MV and making and jacket making stuff. So that's like you know more regular. And then the last things I unboxed this month, and they were in two videos this stack here. So these are the Elf Japan magazines. <clears throat> these are the first four. I did these in one video <clears throat> and these are the next four which I also, <clears throat> also did in one video. So I have the first eight Elf Japan magazines which is very exciting especially because I got them together in one listing so on a great price. Not so great for shipping but it's okay. So <clears throat> It's pretty exciting, so it's not as much as the tapes, but you know, if I didn't get the tapes this month, probably I would be the most excited for these. Although I'm very excited for Boys in City and the Super Show 5 brochure. This was a great Suju month, it's just, oh, I love these kind of months. It's just everything worked out pretty well, so yeah. And of course I already got like two fairly big packages coming, uh, so those are in March. They are like Twice, uh, Bangtan, Cross Jean, Red Velvet, and some other albums that I really needed to get. Uh, <clears throat> and currently I can't remember what else I have, but of course it's in the channel description. So this was a great month, so look at that. So pretty. Oh my god, the tapes. It's a pretty nice shot. Even there is a part of my pillow there. So, thank you so much for watching and see you next month with this kind of video. Bye!